welcome back guys this is question 5.56 and 5.57 which are closely relevant with each other and today we are going to discuss the probability distribution which we are going to follow and solve the questions like these one so in question 5.56 the statement is on every three traffic accidents okay three traffic accidents per month occur at a certain intersection what is the probability that in any given month at this intersection a exactly five accidents will occur b fewer than three accidents will occur and c at least two accidents will occur similarly in 5.57 we are also given some average number of errors in the textbook and all of these questions where the average number of traffic accidents every number of errors average number of items are given and we have to find the exact number of accidents or exact number of errors or some maximum or minimum limit of accidents or errors are given so there what would you do you will have to use the probability distribution which is very famous and that is basically the poisson probability distribution and the formula we are going to use for it is probability that x equal to k that is equal to the exponential of minus lambda and lambda raised to power k divided by the K factorial where lambda is what lambda is the only factor here which is the average value okay so in each question here average values are given this is three and here we have two okay so in order to find them out let me first solve question 5.56 and in solving it let me use this black color okay. now let me solve question 5.56 and in solving it this is the solution and let me first write the given data where the given lambda or the average value is three accidents per month okay so this is lambda in part a of it what do we have to find out exactly five accidents will occur so if suppose x is the number of the accidents we need to find out the probability that x is five in b fewer than three accidents will occur probability that x or the number of accidents are less than three which is here and in c at least two accidents will occur means probability of x is greater or equal to two okay so here we have to find it out and previously i have told you guys that the formula for the poisson distribution here would be what that would be probability of x equal to k that is equal to the exponential of minus lambda lambda k divided by the k factorial which is written here so now as this lambda is given so it is clearly the poisson probability distribution problem so therefore let me write here this p x equal to 5 so for it k is equal to 5 so therefore it would be the exponential of minus 3 and lambda which is 3 as given here this is 3 the value of k is 5 here okay so this is 5 divided by the 5 factorial okay so what would we get exponential of minus 3 this 3 raised to the power of 5 is 243 Okay, multiplying it with it and 5 factorial is 120 okay so finding the value of exponential of minus 3 what would we get 0 0.0498 multiplied by 243 divided by 120 okay and then finding the answer of it the solution would be 0 0.1008 and that is what that is basically the solution for part a of my question okay in part b which in part b which is basically this one let me solve it here okay this is the probability that x is less than 3 this is what this is basically the probability that x is less than or equal to 2 or we can very easily 
write it all the values of x is less than or equal to 2 those would be the probability that x is equal to 0 the probability that x is equal to 1 and the probability that x is equal to 2 okay so these are all what these are all the poisson probability formulas where in each of them i have to use the formula which we have here okay for all of them the values of k are 0 1 2 so let me write their values so in this formula putting these values it would be exponential of minus 3 because the value of the lambda will remain the same okay multiplied by the 3 raised to power 0 divided by the 0 factorial plus exponential of minus 3 into 3 raised to power 1 divided by 1 factorial plus exponential of minus 3 multiplied by 3 raised to power 2 divided by 2 factorial okay so finding it out because the value of exponential minus 3 is already known and then finding the other values the answer of it would be what the answer of it would be 0 0.423 okay so this is the solution for part b of my question in order to proceed to part c of my question let me move down somehow okay so part c of this question is probability of x is greater or equal to 2 we can very easily find it out by 1 minus probability of x is less than 2 okay so it would be what it would be 1 minus the probability of x equal to 0 plus the probability that x is equal to 1 these are the values which are less than 2 so again these are for the Poisson distribution let me write them here 1 minus probability of x equal to 0 it would be x exponential of minus 3 3 raised to the power 0 divided by the 0 factorial plus exponential of minus 3 3 raised to the power 1 divided by 1 factorial for the values of k equal to 0 and 1 okay and then adding them subtracting it from 1 what would i get it would be 1 minus exponential of minus 3 multiplied by 4 so ultimately the answer of it would be 0 0.800 9 okay. so that is what that is basically the solution for part c of my question okay uh, so this is basically the solution for question 5.56 now let us proceed to question 5.57 on average a textbook author makes two word processing errors per page on the first draft of her textbook what is the probability that on the next page she will make four or more errors and be no errors okay so in this question again the average value is given which is two okay and the formula is already given let me move down somehow for this one as well and let me use uh, this blue color for it so this is question 5.57 and in part a of my question i have to find probability that four or more errors are here so if i represent the number of errors with x so x are greater or equal to four so it would be one minus probability that x is less than four okay let me write them here so it would be all the values of x would be probability of x is zero plus the probability that x is equal to one the probability that x is equal to 2 and the probability that x is equal to 3 okay the value of lambda is already given which is what which is 2 so this is here as well okay let me use the same formula which i have used for it which is here which is exponential of minus lambda lambda raised to power k divided by k factorial okay so let me write them here it would be 1 minus exponential of minus 2 2 raised to power 0 divided by 0 factorial plus exponential of minus 2 2 raised to power 1 divided by 1 factorial plus exponential of minus 2 2 raised to power 2 divided by the 2 factorial plus exponential of minus 2 
2 raised to the power 3 divided by the 3 factorial. Okay. So then solving it and finding the answer of it, the answer of it would be 0 0.1441. Okay, and that is what that is basically the solution for part A of my question. And moving to part B of my question, I have to find the probability that we will get no errors. So this is what I want to find out the probability that the number of errors are zero. Okay, this is x equal to zero, or this is the same one as it is here. So therefore, writing it exponential of minus two to the power zero divided by 0 factorial which is same as exponential of minus 2 so the answer of it would be 0 0.135 and that is what that is basically the solution for part b of my question okay so that's it for today in which we have seen the solution of question 5.56 and 5.57 by using the poisson distribution okay which is the formula which we have written here so i hope this is now understandable and if you guys have any question you can ask me in the comment box see you soon